I'm not wild about Camp David. Yes, sir. I'm not the only one, either. Bess Truman didn't like it. I read that somewhere. She thought it was dull. But there I go, Thanksgiving at Camp David. Yeah. It's not a place you'd go at Thanksgiving, not when you have a farm. Isn't Camp David a farm? No. Oh. What makes you think it's a farm? I don't know. It's outside. Farms have things you can grow and animals. Right. I want you to learn more about farms. There's more? Yeah. OK. Doesn't matter. Thanksgiving's where your family is, and this year my family's at Camp David. Why, I do not know. Abby didn't want to schlep to New Hampshire. Schlepping in a 747. It's not like we were going to have to carry our own bags or anything, but I do not argue. Were we talking about something? I don't know, sir. When I came in here back in the late 50s, there was a purpose to it, but then one thing led to another, and I blacked out. I mean, I can hang in there with the best of them, sir, but somewhere during the discussion of anise and coriander and the other 15 spices you like to use to baste a turkey, I simply lost consciousness. You know that line you're not supposed to cross with the president? I'm coming up on it. No, no. Look behind you. Yes, sir. Would you like to leave? With your permission, sir. Damn right, with my permission. Yes, sir. It's the brine that keeps the meat soft, lady. You soak it overnight in water, salt, sugar. 17 kinds 17 of... 17 kinds of spices, including... Anise and coriander. Now you can go. Thank you, Mr. President.